And the halftime score in Champaign is Penn State 47, Illinois 38. The Illini's last lead was 24-23. Their biggest lead was 5 at 19-14. Penn State, though, with a great run to end the half, and they lead it 47-38. Jalen Pickett, 16 points, 6 assists in 20 minutes, and uh, he controlled things for Penn State in that first half. We'll have more stats for you coming up. Stephen Thayer joins us, founder of Next Name. How you doing, sir? I'm doing good. How are you? And a golf partner of Doug Oldberger, yes, yeah. apparently. And more importantly, my son, right? He, yeah, was, the, he was the better player. Oh, you'll see, the, you'll see his son. He bombs yeah. that drive about oh, yeah. 3.30. <laughs> well, good to have you here, Stephen. And Thank Next you. Name. Tell us about Next Name, why you started it, what it is. So, as you know, the Supreme Court last year basically told the NCAA that they're running a monopoly, a billion-dollar business, and they can't pass rules <laughs> preventing kids from making money on their name, image, and likeness. So... They changed the rules of the game, opened up this whole NIL space, and then the question was, is how does a player sell his NIL, right? The easiest thing, we think, is to make a digital collectible or an NFT of his image and sell it to fans. I mean, it's a simple, easy way. They don't have to do a whole lot. So we came up with an NFT platform, selling them on the blockchain, and it's basically a digital baseball card. Yeah, it really is. Yeah, it's, it's, you know, it's, uh, it's pretty cool. Yeah. I mean, it's, uh, you talk about the technology today and being able to do this. In well, this space. And, so, yeah. and, and you can do it for different players, too, I think. Yeah, I we, we can make yeah. one of you, Doug. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what you're asking? Yeah. <laughs> He'd like to do that. I think dion has got one. Right? Yeah, dion has got one. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I, it's a little above me, all that stuff. Yeah. But anyway, it's, yeah. it's, oh, it's well, pretty easy. Yeah, yeah, we'll talk about the tokens and the FT. Why should yeah. people buy them? Yeah, yeah right. So that's the biggest why. question. Um, so I, I think there's probably three buyers out there. There's a the good-hearted fan who says, I want to support the players provide a supplemental scholarship so when they buy an NFT the money goes to the player for the most part um, or you can buy a team token where the money goes to all the players to the good hearted fan then I call the die hard fan the guy that wants Illinois to win and he realizes that we're in a new game and if you don't pay the players or su- provide their NIL support for the players they're going to go play somewhere else we're going to have a transfer portal and uh, I mean some people like it some people don't but the die hard fan is going to be like we're going to buy some tokens and support these players and then the last one is a speculator. He's thinking, maybe I could buy Michael Jordan's rookie card or, you know, a player that's going to be worth something later when he goes in the NBA. So there's a speculative aspect to it as well. But we think one of those three reasons is a good reason to buy it. And I think Illinois, because of their fan base and the number of alumni they have, they have an opportunity to really be the leaders in the industry. They could really blow this out and, you know, support their players and show the whole world that, you know, if you play at Illinois, we support the players. We get behind them and uh, we sell some NFTs and make that big news. I think uh, the recruits across the country will be looking to play at Illinois. Yeah. Stephen Thayer with us for another minute or so. So where can people learn more? How do they find you? Yeah, so nextname.io um, is the easiest place to buy our, your NFT. We've got banners up throughout the stadium. Um, you know, pick a player. We've got different versions of NFTs you can buy. You can buy a basic token for 25 bucks. Team token for 30, 100, or 1,000. We've got a Chase Brown token, a gold version of it. We're coming out some gold versions of players. They're a little more rare tokens. So if you're, and when, you know, once you get into it, you get kind of addicted. You start buying tokens and players, and you know, down the road, we're going to be, you'll be able to enter these players into some sort of game. We're talking to some people right now about kind of creating some more utility, almost like a, uh, you know, a fantasy football basketball league where you have to buy the NFT to get the player. But that's down the road. It's just a, it's a cool thing. You're going to buy an NFT now, and you're going to own it forever. It's going to be sitting on yeah. the blockchain. So yeah. we'll see. Steven, thanks for coming by. Great. Thanks Appreciate for it. Me, Good luck. Appreciate Steven it. Thayer with Next Name. Go to nextname.io. Back with more after this.